I'm joined by the 2020 uh, Doig medalist, uh, Luke Ryan joins us and Rhino, how's that jumper mate? Yeah. The retro, the retro uh, anchor looks fantastic, what do you think? Yeah, I like it, last year's was pretty good and this is, uh, yeah, not a bad, not a bad jumper. I like the 3D anchor and then the box at the back looks pretty cool. Last year you won as well, let's hope it happens again for retro round. Now last weekend there was a draw of course, which is always a, a bizarre feeling at the end of the match. Um, would you like to play extra time or go golden goal or golden point or a shootout, anything? Uh, yeah, golden goal wouldn't be too bad at Etihad, but I reckon if you play anywhere else, the conditions will come into it and the uh, coin toss will probably uh, weigh too much. So, um, yeah, I'm happy with a draw at the moment. You're happy with a draw? Look, I know Michael Frederick and uh, Jordan Clark got a lot of the highlights and a lot of the headlines for their performance in the last quarter, obviously, and the smother from Freddie was fantastic. But your tackle on Shea Bolton, absolutely crucial, almost a match winner. Talk us through that. Uh, yeah, he's uh, he's a pretty crafty player, Shy, and um, yeah, I think he ducked, got out of one or two, and then lucky enough he was a bit tired and a bit slow, so I can actually catch him and got, <laughs> got lucky enough to stick the tackle. So uh, yeah, I was pretty lucky in the end, and um, lucky to hold on to two points. Mate, it was fantastic. And Hayden Young, best on ground. Geez, a good young player, isn't he? Are you doing much with him as well as some of the other coaches? Yeah, there's a lot of people working into him. He's a fast learner. I haven't seen anything like it. He's got the best kick at the club, and um, yeah, he's getting better and better every week. And I think he's overtaken a few boys, so um, yeah, he's a great signing for the club. He's going to be a future leader as well, I think, of the club as well. So look forward to seeing what he can do. A cheeky one. At the end of the game, do you reckon you'll speak to Luke Jackson and Angus Brayshaw, tell them how good Coburn is? Oh yeah, they are. I think they already know. Nah, um, yeah, no. Nah. I don't know what's going on for their trade stuff. I stay out of it, and whatever happens, happens. But um, I know they're both two good guys, and who wouldn't want him on the list? So anyone would try and take him. You're having a brilliant season, mate. All the best, Dane. Hope you do well against the Demons. Cheers. Thank you.